everybody. I have another really quick, anytime, no excuses workout, and it's specifically geared towards television watching, so a TV workout. And that's because, let's face it, if we are watching television, we're not exactly changing the world. And so it's taking that time and doing something productive with it. And this is also a really good workout for absolutely any time. Uh, you could drop down and do it right now. You don't need any kind of extensive warm up. And it's also really good for times like I'm going through right now, which is because of an evil tooth that I had a root canal on that is abscessing again. I've had to break down and go on a round of antibiotics. And I fought, I fought so hard and I lost the fight. So. I'm trying to be a good patient and do what they say, which is keep things on the low-key side of things and just give my body a little bit of a break as it's on the antibiotics. So that's what I'm doing and workouts like these are lifesavers for me because you're able to maintain that consistency and it's really, really essential both physically and psychologically. So it keeps you on track and something is always better than nothing. So here's what you're going to do if you're watching TV you're going to do this round of exercises during the commercial breaks and it's just fine if you don't finish out by the time the show's back on because you can do all of this while you have your eyes cut over at the TV so make sure you finish each round if you're not watching TV just go through three or four rounds of this and it's an awesome little power packed um, toning workout for some trouble spots specifically your booty and your abs and kind of the sides of the waist so if you guys are ready we're gonna go ahead and get started the number to remember is 15 you're gonna do 15 reps of all of this and all you need is some kind of dining room chair or some other kind of elevated surface so it could pretty much be anything you can use the coffee table if you're not very against all the feet on the coffee table stuff but you're just gonna Get yourself about a foot, foot and a half away from the chair. Heels on the chair, head back, arms out to the side. Pick a leg to stick up into the air first, and you're just doing elevated bridge ups. And you will immediately, within doing this one time, feel this in your hamstring. So this is awesome for your booty and also the back of your thigh. So every time you come up, hold for a beat, squeeze your booty, and then back down. 15 on that side, switch feet, same thing. 15 and now for the abdominal exercises you're going to keep your heels placed on the edge of the chair 90 degree angle between the hips and the knees hands behind the head and you're going to alternate sides so you're going to do 15 on one side then you're going to do 15 on the other side so complete one full round and all you're going to do is take one leg out to the side and as you bring the leg up crunch and hold leg down to the side crunch, hold, and you actually end up engaging completely different muscles running through the side of the waist with that simple little action of the leg. So it's really important to control as much as you possibly can and pull in and hold for a beat at the top. Then you're going to do the same thing on the other side, crunch and hold, down, crunch and hold and you're just lightly tapping that heel, you're not banging it down on any surface. In fact, if you want to make it a little bit more challenging, don't touch that foot to the ground or the seat of the chair. 15, 15, 15, 15, and you're up. Next commercial break, you do it again. Try to get in three or four rounds of this, and like I said, it's awesome little mini toning workout for some trouble spots, especially for women. So, hope you guys enjoy this. Keep the feedback coming, and I have something I'm putting together as far as like a December holiday challenge so that we all stay on track. I'm working on that right now, but I hope you have an awesome, happy, healthy, blessed week, and I appreciate you guys. See you again later. Bye.